National Spouses Day on January 26th each year celebrates the bond between two people and sets aside time for couples to show each other gratitude. Is there any married person here? <laughs> well, there isn't. They left the group chat. So come on. Happy spouses. <laughs> Happy spouses. Happy spouses. Happy spouses. <laughs> And we look forward to celebrating. To join us. Honestly. Yeah, we, can, we can't wait. We can't wait. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Uh, Damla, what do you find in the news for us today? What I found in the news is very interesting and surprising and confusing. Oh, wow. Honestly, because the headline is, Bullion Vans at Tinubu's house missed address. I was first confused, like, okay, <laughs> how? I mean, I didn't get it. <laughs> you know, and I say the Lagos State Organizing Secretary of All Congress, All Progressive Congress, Ayodele Adewale, has claimed the bullion vans seen driving into Bola Tinubu's residence on the eve of the 20, on of the eve of the 2029 presidential election missed its way there. Mm -hmm. I mean, apparently there was there was this viral video mm -hmm. or rather picture mm -hmm. on internet that um, on the eve of the 2019 election there were two vans spotted at um, Tinubu's house, and then. Now, Adewale is coming here to tell us that the vans <laughs> missed their road. So they were supposed to go to the bank or somewhere else, and then they missed their road there. And I'm like, May a van I'm miss so roads to our houses in Jesus. So, <laughs> so, so after five years, that was all they could come they up come with. That was all they could come dumb. up As a matter of fact, he said that, and, and this case is already settled <laughs> and it has died now. So why are we bringing it up again? You know, so that's all. yeah, that's all. So since, well, so since Nigerians are gullible and vulnerable, we'll mm. just take it. Okay. I mean, they told us that a snake swallowed 36 million. No, <laughs> yes, yes. So so I'm here. So things what? weird things have been yeah, known to very, happen. Very, very weird. So. Yeah, so. You know, it's Africa, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> MJ, please, what you be finding in the news? Yes, for? um, so my story is. Federal government says that one, 159 Nigerians renounced their citizenship in 2022. So the federal government um, says not fewer than 159 Nigerians renounced their citizenship in 2022 alone. The permanent secretary of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs um, disclosed this at the 64th um, session of the State House Ministerial Briefing, organized by the presidential communications team at the presidential villa on Thursday 26. So he stated that 150 Nigerians renounced their citizenship between 2006 to 2021. So <laughs> okay. <laughs> so um this well it's uh, I I don't know I have mixed feelings cuz I'm I'm asking myself I'm like okay why are people renouncing their citizenship why can't you just get dual citizenship then then again i'm like if i had a blue passport i would consider i would actually consider it but we are shown shaggy on a daily basis so so if you can imagine if you uh if you have the opportunity to actually get a second mm. citizenship you'll rather hold up that than hold up because mm. of and why do people do this because of travel ease yeah. visa ease mm -hmm. and all that with other nationalities as opposed to when you have a nigerian passport and how nigerians are actually viewed when they Presents present yeah. their green longer queue, passports. longer yeah. queue. So you know. it's, uh, I <sighs> wish I could have a second One day. citizenship, so I can have an opportunity to mm -hmm. actually make a decision. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, just, right. just the opportunity. Right. To have the option. Right. I would appreciate it. Right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. So yes. Yeah, so for my what's in the news, well, um, CBN to sanction banks who are rejecting the old naira notes. Mm. So I mean, first of all, we know that the announcement was very sudden. Yeah. And most people that were are in Lagos, Abuja, and Port Harcourt, which is like the major cities in Lagos, where mm -hmm. it's easy for us to just say we want to. Sure. But the banks were rejecting money. And most people in the rural area who are market women, and you know, these women don't go to the banks every day. You will see them with their small nylon mm -hmm. of money that mm -hmm. they are mm -hmm. keeping at home to make it plenty to yeah, take to the take bank. The and then now the bank is rejecting it. So um, the news basically is saying that. <clears throat> Excuse me. While, while field questioning from journalists yesterday, the Yola Adamawa State um, CBM Director, the Internal uh, Internal Audit, Mrs. Ladi Alpha, said the Apex Bank would consider would consider such action from any commercial bank as sabotage and treat them accordingly to its law. So please, guys, as you're watching this, help us to pass the message to Nigerians all over the all over the country. Wherever you are, you need to take your narrow notes, the old one. 
back to the bank and they will exchange it to give you the current notes just to ensure that at least your money is in the bank. So please take your money to the bank as quickly as possible because the banks will be sanctioned. And yeah. if you go to any bank and they refuse, you can because do a video and report step. Definitely. <laughs> right. Yeah. Thank you, Alera. Thank you. Okay, so um, my Watson News, new Nara notes, NASS films at CBN insist on January 31st deadline. So against expectation, the Central Bank of Nigeria has set that the January 31st, 2023 deadline for the higher denominations of old banknotes ceased to function as legal tender. And many have expected the CVN to extend the deadline beyond the January 31 date for the sake of Nigerians in riverine areas, uplands and other remote areas who do not ordinarily have access to banking services in their immediate locations. I picked this because this is tied to what we're discussing, mm -hmm. what we'll be discussing mm -hmm. much later um, today. So yeah, see you after the break.